My dear student, the last class we learned about Mikhali. Do you remember the story? How many of you have read the lesson? Few. Am I right? No. All of you have read. Okay. Good. Then we have seen that Mikhali wanted and he carrying the burden. The infant, his brother on his shoulder. He couldn't go out for work because the burden was on his shoulder. And the infant, the baby, and was crying continuously. The famished birth baby. Because there was a single pie in his hand, in his pocket, to buy milk for the birth. There was no feeding mother in the cow. And also, because he created the babe, created problem to his neighbors. So they drove him away from there. And he was wandering uh, Then we see that Then somebody told him There was a feeding mother In the Anatolian's cow So he went with his baby there So the woman asked him to open the sack and when they saw the skeletonic baby the body they wondered and they cried aloud and asked him to get away from there that was the condition and he lost all hope and horror then, women gave vent to various cries of horror. The child had no longer anything human about it. We can't say that it is a human baby. And the head had become enormous. And the body of an incredible thinness. And that is the... And also, I think that we have uh, seen those portion. Okay, that paragraph also we have. All of them together chased him away. They asked him to get away from them. They drove him away because seeing the baby threatening. His eyes filled with tears. He cried, wept. He went off. Go off, went off. Go off means he explored or go out quickly. And it is a price sell where all of you know what is hearing the little child still wailing. It's a... And it was wailing, it was crying, it was crying because of hunger. Then there was nothing to be done. The child was then condemned to die of hunger. Sometimes it was its fate because the baby's fate. We will share Kutuda fate with the other idea. Yangene, we send the Purin Yumerikua and Idika. Baby Mikali felt himself immensely alone and lost. And he has lost everything. He has no strength because he has also no food here. Sometimes he may get some stale food. Okay. A chill ran up his spine at the thought of that he was carrying such an unlucky child. He thought he was carrying an unlucky child. And he slumped down in the shadow of a shed. He slumped down means he dropped. On the shadow of a shed, 
then he but we have seen that the ladies ordered him to get away from here and he left the place and one day okay. then he reached then well then he thought that he was an unlucky fellow and he jumped and down the shadow of a shed he came there and he sat there it was still it was still understand he sat there abo he came there you have seen that abo vidhike petta gudi the chill ran up his spine at the thought that he was carrying such an unlucky fellow he felt that he was carrying an unlucky fellow wherever he went people uh oh, drove him out chased him. the country spread out before him and before him the country spread before and in arid and waste and arid means barren and waste and land covered with refuse that means waste and noon rang out somewhere the sound reminded him that he had eaten nothing abo he said there the country then before him tande munila vishalamai kidakuna pradesham barren tarishaya bhoomi waste land covered with refuse means waste angane chappu javaru niranju kidakuna pradesham neendu nivarnu kidakunu pole thoni noon rang out somewhere somewhere he heard the sight bell aayirikam sirena ga kuchayai the sound reminded him that he had eaten nothing since the day before he had eaten nothing since the day before thalene onnum kalichil ഇപ്പോഴും ഒന്നുമില്ല പക്ഷെ അതിനെ കുറിച്ച് ചിന്തിക്കുവാൻ അവനാകുന്നില്ല വൈ ബിക്കോസ് ഹി വാണ്ട്സ് ടു സേവ് ദ ലൈഫ് ഓഫ് ഹിസ് യങ് ബ്രദർ ദ ഇൻ ഫാൻ ഹി വാണ്ട്സ് ടു സേവ് ദ ലൈഫ് ഓഫ് ദ ഇൻ ഫാൻ ബട്ട് വാട്ട് ക്യാൻ ഹി ഡു ബിക്കോസ് ഇറ്റ് വാണ്ട്സ് സം അതിന് വേണ്ടത് എന്താണ് മിൽക്ക് and uh, no penny with him how is it possible that that is the problem before him then nothing had before he would have to go sneaking and go sneaking about the street and round cave terraces and also flinching some half eaten roll left on plate or else and rake about in the garbage for what a dog would not have eaten so the only way he has to find food food kandathuvanulla and also he would have to go and sneaking means going secretly about the street terivilude rahasyamayi poi evideyengil okke kidakunnu ulli parakkiye kandathuke okke cheyga around cafe terraces e cafe de terrasil mettum waste kondu thallum and filching some half eaten road left on plate plate il thinnada aalkar ubheshichu they have left it avada kondu thalli ke waste il and steal it adine motichedukam kaanade അതും ഇങ്ങനെയുള്ള ലെഫ്റ്റ് ആൻഡ് പ്ലേറ്റ് ഓറൽസ് ആൻഡ് റൈറ്റ് ആൻഡ് അബൌട്ട് ഇൻ ദ ഗാർബേജ് ഫോർ വാട്ട് ഡോ ഗുഡ് നോട്ട് ഹാവ് ഈറ്റ് ഒരു പക്ഷേ പട്ടികൾ പോലും തിന്നാതെ ഉപേക്ഷിച്ച പട്ടിക്ക് വേണ്ട അത്ര മോശമായി അതെങ്കിലും കിട്ടിയാൽ ഇതൊക്കെയാണ് സഡൻലി ലൈ സീം ഡിറ്റ് ഹിം ടു ഫുൾ ഓഫ് ഹൊറേഡ് ദെൻ ഹി തോട്ട് അബൌട്ട് ലൈ ഇറ്റ് വാസ് ഹൊറർ എല്ലാം ഭയം മാത്രമാണ് തന്നെ പേടിപ്പെടുത്തുന്ന രൂപങ്ങൾ തൻ്റെ മുന്നിലേക്ക് ഒന്നൊന്നായി വരുന്നത് അപ്പൊ തൻ്റെ മുന്നിൽ ഭീതിപ്പെടുത്തുന്ന രൂപങ്ങൾ ഒരു വക കിട്ടാനില്ല ആരെങ്കിലും തിന്ന് ഉപേക്ഷിച്ച വസ്തുക്കളും എവിടെയെങ്കിലും കയറി ആരും കാണാതെ പ്ലേറ്റിൽ ഉപേക്ഷിച്ച് വെച്ചത് മോട്ടിച്ചെടുക്കാനും അല്ലെങ്കിൽ പട്ടി പോലും വേണ്ടാതെ ഉപേക്ഷിച്ചിട്ട് പോയതെടുക്കാനും ഒക്കെ അല്ലാതെ പാട്ടിയാൽ 
and some eaten plate right about in the garbage and not have eaten. Suddenly life seemed him so full of courage that he covered his faith with his hand and began to sob desperately. And he covered his face with the hands and wept. Karadalangund mukham putti tengi hai. Apoorum undu pharam aran the young bird. When he raised his head, a man stood before him gazing down upon him. And when he raised his head, he found a man was standing before him, listening him. Kurachi kadinye. Mukham Vyarthi Nokia Pool Tanda Munil Kunduri Manish Tanda Stratichu Mundi he happened to see a man was standing before him. And also who was gazing down upon him, he was looking carefully and Mikali recognized the China man, he recognized this man because this he was a, a visitor in their camp. He had visited their camp so many occasions because he wanted to uh, sell some handicrafts he had made. I had another message handicrafts and But nobody but nobody bought anything from him. That man was standing before he walked. China man he open come to the camp to sell paper knickknacks. Okay, he had come there. Paper go to la kaudu ka vastikal he had made it. Adane knickknacks he had made knickknacks. Okay, and the charms which no one ever bought from him any. But they didn't buy. Nobody bought. Aru mangi nila, but he visited there. Settlement colony. Okay. Often they mocked him, they mocked him, they made fun of him, they teased him. Kaliyaki because of his color. You know the color of a China man, all of you know, color. And his skin eye, and a skin eye, Kongan. Kongan nulla, a Kongan nanaya, China kind of chappi a move. The skin the eyes. Mikale saw that he was looking gently down at him. Then he found he was and gazing down at him and moving his lips as through to speak. Mikale saw that he was looking gently down at him and moving his lips. That means he wants to speak something to him through to speak. Finally, the China, China man said, you must cry. Don't cry. Stop crying. My boy, stop it. Cry. Boy, stop it, please. Then timidly, come with me. Another child will why do you please come with me. You don't cry. Please come with me. Mikhail's only answer was to shake his head. He shake his head. No, I don't like to come. Negative. He longed to flee. Then he longed to. He wished it to flee from there. Kudichu in the Yugotan Lulichola. Flee from there. To escape from there. He had heard so many horrors about the cruelty of the, the Orientals. And he had heard so many stories about the cruelties of the Oriental, means the people of Eastern countries. Oriental. Oriental means the people from Eastern countries. Our Eastern countries in Alkada, Kurdagal, Dushtagal, Wakavi, what created under Abadagunda Venda. Oh, the China man invited him. Get up, boy, you get up. Please come with me. Please come with me. But 
she answered negative. A negative answer here, no? And yet the man remained there, but he didn't leave the place. He remained there and did not, and birds, did not birds to move a very little, to move very little. But, so being in great distress, Mikhalai follow. Arach, arach. Move very little, that means follow. That was the problem. And he had heard a lot about the cruelties of Oriental peoples. He had heard that. Then what I have to do? And he thought about it. Okay, then. Followed him. That was the only the last, I said, last resort. He followed him. Resort. What more awful thing could happen to him? As they walked along, he stumbled weakly and almost fell with the child while they were walking. What happened? Stumbled weakly because of tiredness, had nothing in his stomach. Okay. And weakly and almost fell with the child. You know, the China man came to him and taking the baby in his arm. Really, he was a kind man. Though poor, he has a mind, helping mind. The China man, the baby in his arm. About his shade. Of her, the burden tenderly pressed it to him. So he took the baby and in his arm tenderly pressed it to him. He closed his body. Sharira told the chair to be the chua kunine snake of Guru. Who? The China man. The China man came to him and taking the baby. In his arms tenderly pressed it to him. Okay. They crossed several empty plot. Empty lot. Lot means plot. Not on the Dura Sai, Stalangaludi, Uriwad, Plotagaludi. And then the man took a little lane. After that, they turned to a little lane. Uri Cheri Abadi, Uri Dabadi Bolo, Kochi Badi lane. And led them to a sort of wooden cabin. They reached what kind of house we see? Wooden cabin, wooden, all of it. A cabin made of wood. Tadil Nurmicha, Tadil Talkaliga by Tati Kutia, Levandikada Vurula cabin. Surrounded by a very small garden. And also he could see it was surrounded by a small garden. It was made of wood. He stopped before the door and he clapped his hands to his. They stopped there before the where the wooden cabin. A wooden cabin. A vidabola kochi uri cabin. Cabin means a small room. Our room is a cabin. Surrounded by very small garden. Oh. And then he, what did he, he clapped his hands twice. He clapped his hands. How many times? Twice. Twice. A few light steps inside. Then he heard. Mikhailai heard some slight steps inside. Aryo Agatha Nadak Natila Stepugal Step. Inside, and a tiny person came to open the door. Tiny, smart person. Pokangura, not tall. Seeing, seeing the man, her reddened, that face reddened. That means Amukamon Chuvan, Irony Mama. Sandosha Gondari, yes, yes. 
ओके एंड देन ए हैप्पी स्माइल कर दो ए हैप्पी स्माइल शी प्रसन्न द हैप्पी स्माइल लिट इट अप कर दो कर फेस रेडेंड एंड देन ए हैप्पी स्माइल लिट इट अप शी मेड ए ब्रीफ कोर्टसी टू द कोर्टस वेरी बिने ये बोल hesitatingly rooted to the threshold he stood the threshold are a threshold vadal pad okay. he stood there door aba door inde avade thanne kutti adichathu pole nu veru unni adu pole veru vidichathu pole nu the china man said to him come in then please come in do not be afraid don't worry this is my wife my wife this is my wife you don't know. come on mikhale went into the room then he entered the room rather large it seemed large it seemed it is a large but separated in middle by a color paper screen ab it is a, just like a hall but it is a separated and using paper curtain paper il nirmicha curtain konde adine randa aki tirichirikunu separate adine rendu bhagama aki maati okay ah cheri hall by colored paper screen by colored papers it was also clean and neat that was the important he noticed though it was a cat it was so neat and clean though very poor looking in the corner he noticed and also though then clean and neat though very poor looking poor looking that means uh, there they couldn't see costly furniture or any avade costly aayulla furniture onnum illa വലിയ ചെയർ മറ്റ് അങ്ങനെ ഒന്നുമില്ല ഇൻ ദ കോർണർ ഹി നോട്ടീസ്ഡ് അതായത് വേയിലുണ്ടാക്കിയ മുള കൊണ്ടുണ്ടാക്കിയ നമ്മൾ ചൂരിൽ ഉണ്ടാക്കുന്നുണ്ടല്ലോ അതുപോലെ മുളയോ ചൂരിലോ കൊണ്ടുണ്ടാക്കിയ ഒരു തൊട്ടിൽ കുഞ്ഞു തൊട്ടിൽ കണ്ടു ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് മൈ ബേബി എന്താണ് ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് മൈ ബേബി സെറ്റ് ദ യങ് ഊമൺ ദെൻ ദ ഊമൺ സെറ്റ് ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് മൈ ബേബി അത് എൻ്റെ പൊന്നു മോന സെറ്റ് ദ യങ് ഊമൺ ആൻഡ് കൊക്കിങ് ഹർ ഹെഡ് ആൻഡ് ഗ്രേഷ്യസ് Cooking her means raising her head. Thala uyarthi abhimana purasana par. Cooking her head graciously means respectfully with great respect. Polana vinaya purasana maanu thala uyarthi abar purasana maanu. Adhe nja. Nanu. To one side and smiling at him. At the same time she is smiling. He is very tiny. Mikhali found he is very tiny slim and very beautiful and come and see and he is very tiny kare kore very beautiful come and see varu nokku sundarana sundara kuttanan Mikhali went up closer he went up closer that means he approached near then reach the near closer and silently admired oh, what a beauty he found and answer oh 
Aunt made it color. A chubby baby. Chubby fat baby. Nala Tadichikuri the Paraka Kudichikanamula Chubby baby. Chubby means that baby. But lately, but lately, out of the darkness of the maternal maternal body, the maternal body slept peacefully, covered with a gold brocade cloth like a lid. Then look at you. And also, but lately. Lately, out of the darkness of the maternal body, slept peacefully. Kurachin slept peacefully. Covered with a gold brocade, and his body was covered with, and brocade means a decorated cloth. Beautifully decorated cloth wonder Adida Moody Rik in the Pudachirik Adi Manok like a little girl king and seems to be a king with Raja Kumar Little King Kuch Raja Kumar in the Lichanamun Ave. Then the husband called his wife over and he told her to sit on the straw. Then the husband called his wife over. The husband, the China man called her, dear, come on darling, come here. He told her to sit on a straw man and asked her to sit on a straw man. Where you? He piled. Without a word, that means she was so obedient. Without a word, he, uh, without a word, he sat down on her lap, a little famished one. Without a word, he sat down on her lap, without saying anything. What did he do? Saying a word, sat down. Set down her lap the little famished one, the hungry baby he placed. He placed the hungry baby on her lap without saying anything oh. and bowing deeply before her. The woman and leaned over with astonishment. <laughs> Surprised because seeing the figure and drew back the covering in which the child was wrapped. Then moved the cover, the sack, the cloth, and it appeared to her in all its a skeletonic horror, a skeletonic boy. And she one day seeing. She gave a cry. She cried. Cry of immense pity because of pity. She cried. Then pressed the babe to her heart. And then she pressed the babe, baby in her heart. Giving it the breast. Then with a gesture of modesty valare samarthamai and she brought forward a flap of her robe over the milk swollen breast then suddenly what did she do and a flap forward a flap of her robe that means what's the flap means pali and the milk swollen breast pali chiranna maridam adu enne aa kunjini koduthu and Gatonas and infant sucking there. Greedy baby 